people are planting cherry laurel in their gardens, the seeds from that shrub can be carried off far and wide uh, kilometers. If it lands in a habitat, it can destroy that habitat. So you need to be very careful with what you plant. Uh, it's one of the greatest threats to our remaining native woodlands. They create a permanent evergreen shadow over the forest floor and prevent any other light from growing. And in the Irish climate, they can grow to the size of trees and eventually block out the trees in the forest, preventing succession. So when the large trees fall, there's nothing left to replace them. There's wild garlic everywhere. And wild garlic is an ancient indicator species. The seeds don't travel very far, which means that if they're here, they've been here since the beginning. So this is a native woodland that was suffocated by the cherry laurel. We have removed the cherry laurel, light is coming back, the birds are singing. This is a, a potential biofuel. This could be a great alternative to buying firewood, that you can become the steward of your local woodland, harvest the cherry laurel, heat your homes, and in the process, save your local forest. We had three days, and in three days, we collected 28 ton bags. So three days with 30 people. I think this methodology, if adapted nationwide, could solve a legacy ecological problem. I think we could actually fix this issue so we can move on to other issues. You need to work as a community. 